Hey guys, welcome back to the show. So today we're in Greenville, Tennessee again. Uh, where are we at today? We're at Camo Kitchen, which is located at 1001 West Main Street. All right, so we are starving. It's a really nice day out. Uh, hopefully you'll hear us well. We now have a microphone. I don't know if you can I see that. I want to touch <laughs> Just like... <laughs> if you haven't seen that video already, I'll try to put a link somewhere here on how we actually got that accomplished with a cell phone. But anyways, uh, on to what we're really after is the food. Let's go in and eat. Alright guys, so we just got done eating at Camo Kitchen. First impressions? It was very patriotic. Yes. So inside they very much support the military as far as Marines, mm -hmm. uh, Army, Army, Air okay. Force. Uh, I think they were all represented a little bit here and a little bit there. Yeah. Uh, but it is a restaurant, so let's go to the food. Uh, what did you get? I got the Chicken Philly uh, cheese. Wait. Cheese steak. Cheese steak, yeah. And you had? I got the Peggy Ann donut burger. And I had the uh, BLT, which had a fried green tomato on it mm -hmm. and Southwest sauce. Uh, we're gonna save yours for the last. Yeah. So first, uh, let's talk about drink options. We don't mm -hmm. normally go this route, but they had a lot of drink options. Uh, you had your normal soda stuff, but what else did they have? They had blackberry tea, peach tea, and what else did they raspberry. also have? Raspberry. Raspberry tea. And unsweet tea for all y'all psychopaths. <laughs> and the blackberry was my favorite. Yes, uh, all three of us really enjoy the blackberry mm -hmm. tea. It was really good. And they had peach tea, which I normally don't like, but I really liked it too. Mm -hmm. uh, and the sweet tea was really good too. Uh, all right, so let's talk about your food first. I got the chicken Philly cheesesteak with okra. Okay, uh, what about your cheesesteak? Oh my gosh, it was delicious. It had onions, it had che uh, Swiss cheese and chicken, which was, the chicken was seasoned really well and it was really juicy and um, the sandwich all in all was really great. Yeah, it was really good oh. and pretty good size. Go ahead. Yes, and, the, and the okra, it was really uh, hot and fresh. Yes, I really did like the chicken, uh, the chicken seasoning was really good on that yes. as well. Uh, the braid was really fresh. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to talk about mine and then we'll get into Ruby's at the very end. Uh, <laughs> hers is the most interesting. Mine <laughs> is just... Uh, so I had the BLT and I had the just regular fries. Mm -hmm. uh, the fries had like a beer batter. Beer batter? Nobody can talk in this car today. <laughs> the, the fries had like a beer batter on them. They were really good. Mm -hmm. Uh, really crispy, really hot, yeah. and there was a lot of them. Uh, the BLT had bacon, lettuce, and a fried green tomato mm -hmm. and a Southwest sauce. I really enjoyed it. It was really good. I don't even like tomatoes, but I love fried green tomatoes. Um, the bacon was a really thick bacon. The only thing I didn't like about it is instead of using like just regular lettuce they use shredded lettuce so every time i picked it up i lost part of it and i had to like put my sandwich back together every single bite but all in all it had a wonderful taste to it it's really really good really tasty really fresh uh the bread i don't know what they seasoned the bread with i don't know if it, it was more than just butter uh whenever they toasted the bread i don't know what else they put on it but it was very good yes uh, it was a very good sandwich i enjoyed it a lot all right, and let's talk about the donut in the room. Yes. <laughs> okay, this is my first time trying this, and I was a little apprehensive at first. Um, the, the lady behind the counter, she recommended how the fried eggs should be. Well, I'm first, you may want to tell them what you had. Yeah. Okay, well, let's back up a little bit. <laughs> I had a donut burger. It had cheddar cheese. It had thick bacon on it. It was on a toasted Peggy Ann's glazed donut and let me tell you <laughs> it was messy it was oh, gooey yeah. <laughs> it was absolutely positively something worth trying 
I enjoyed it immensely. So this burger was seasoned really well. It all overall, it was absolutely delicious. What was the hardest part deciding on this burger? The fried eggs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like running eggs. I'm very fickle about my eggs. So the lady behind the counter was very, very helpful. So I really appreciate her a great deal. And it was cooked just about the way I like it. All right, so would you order again? I would, yes. All right, so I tried it as well. One, I'm really, really picky on eggs. That's the reason why y'all don't see me eat eggs on camera very much or even talk about eggs very much. Uh, I tried it without the egg. I am not a fan. Uh, it is fine for some people. <laughs> you shush. Uh, no, I would never order that. Uh, it was just, I, you know, as weird and as odd as I am, no. Just some <laughs> things should not be. Roxy, what did you think about it? I loved it. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong we, with him. We had to really get her to pick it up, encourage her to eat this, and then when she took a bite, she was so, the look on her face, <laughs> it was like she was in heaven. Uh, would you order it? Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah. Without the egg. <laughs> Without the egg, yes. Alright, so uh, as far as the cheesesteak, would you order that again? The chicken yes. cheesesteak? Mm -hmm. I would definitely go back for the BLT as well. Yes. All three of us are really, really full. It's a really, really, really friendly, clean business. Yes. Uh, down on Main Street, uh, mm -hmm. I think they get overlooked. I think maybe they're a little too camouflaged. Maybe they need to put a big orange flag out there and say, yes, come on in. Uh, just super, super friendly yes. and helpful. Uh, would highly, highly recommend checking out the Camo Kitchen. Mm -hmm. uh, so all three of us, tax included, I think was $30, which is about average for us eating out. Mm -hmm. Uh, really, really enjoyed today's lunch. It was very, very good. And we encourage people, go get you some food at Camo Kitchen. Yes. They will serve you right. <laughs> you sound like an ad. <laughs> Skip ad right here. <laughs> In five <laughs> seconds. Oh, uh, wait. And then there's another sponsored ad. Sponsored <laughs> ad. Anyways, uh, guys, thank you so much for being with us. Make sure... <laughs> Make sure you like and subscribe. Hit that bell icon below. You'll get more videos like this. Maybe even better. <laughs> Just, Just Rounds, I mean Smashy Boys and Smash Girls. <laughs> God loves you. So do we. Bye, y'all. Right, until next time, guys. <laughs>welcome back to the show so today we're at camo kitchen do you know what address sorry <laughs> <laughs> well it's really supporting the armed services so you had uh stars. marines stars <laughs> stars everywhere <laughs> y'all don't even know uh, oh, all right wait right here okay go <laughs> Um, I got the chili cheese. Philly cheese. Chicken. Chicken, <laughs> we, chicken, <laughs> chicken Philly. Ch <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Chicken, no. Number 14. <laughs> it's the chicken Philly cheesesteak. Chicken Philly cheese. We're still recording. You know that, right? I know. All right. Ch and? Uh, <laughs> and okra. Okay. You want to try that all again? Okay. <laughs>